speaking of your pitch initially i'm sure it got improved throughout the years how was it that you explained baby chakra to the accelerator program that they took you in and from there on the journey began you know we we went through a bunch of evolutions of baby chakra mm. of course right so initially we started off with a discovery platform of care for mothers right mm. so almost like imagine like a like a uh, just not a just dial but like a trip advisor if you will for parenting yeah so we'd list all the local services around you which would do with like let's say preschools or education mm. or hospitals or pediatricians gynax life you know stem cell banking um, all of, like parks also like we listed all of that yeah so when i was talking about it i basically say we want to be like the ultimate platform for parents to discover care mm. now what ended up happening was parents were discovering care of local services mm. but they were also discovering care through each other yeah. because in the comments in the reviews of the services people were commenting to each other saying but how are you doing now how is your little mm. one you are looking at this park i also live close by should we meet up or this doctor ko advice puchna yeah and so then that's when you realize you're solving the wrong problem mm. people want to connect with each other right. and they want to connect with the experts then we kind of pivoted a little bit to make mm. that community come to life got it but uh, when you listed these uh, names didn't you think that it would be something similar to a search engine only which people can anyways get on google so why should someone come on the app specially to find these things um so it's like zomato right yeah i mean you could <laughs> look for a restaurant on on the website yeah. and you would get a google listing and why do you download zomato yeah you get reviews you get like hyper personalized mm. local recommendations you get to see real experiences from people yeah that's what we built it around and we did a lot of product hacks to actually grow this up we wanted the very first companies to you know we were like we were looking at three cities and covering all the parenting services in them at scale we were one of the first companies in in india to uh, to basically deploy a chatbot now chatbots are pretty mainstream yeah. right that point in time no one had heard of a chatbot mm. we deployed a chatbot which would actually um, you know get like would talk to a vendor and basically take the vendor's details in a mm. very conversational format and that improved our conversion rates yeah. like and also efficiency and optimization mm. rates from literally like i think 10 services on board a day to about i think 150 yeah right so we were able to very rapidly cover base mm. and i think when we finally moved away from that model we had about 20000 services the other product integration we did was because of our facebook partnership uh, we talked to the product team at facebook and you know this is the time when facebook was really big yeah, right correct and you remember facebook pages on services yeah. used to like on on businesses used mm. to be there right and those used to solicit reviews from people yeah. and we said how do we grow out reviews so we did a partnership with the mm. facebook pages team in the valley and we said can we use your plugin mm. and that was we were the only company in india to have that where they would show up automatically on our site oh all the reviews from the pages so immediately or instantly plugging in like hundreds of thousands right. of reviews across relevant services mm. onto a baby chakra site so when someone comes in there's never like one site one A service that has no reviews. Yeah, it's wow. all plugged in. But how did you convince them to do this for you? You just have to ask them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, I, like I, is it like? I'm sure it must be difficult to get Facebook to get their data on your platform. So I, I think it's uh, again, uh, you know, what ended up happening was that um, at that point in time, Baby Chakra had gone a certain journey, mm. right? So it was very well known, and you know, we were being invited to panels and things. and uh, the facebook india team got in touch and okay. said that we want to invite you for a meeting with mark zuckerberg oh so that's how i landed up in the valley to meet him and talk about what we were building at baby chakra and the communities we were building and through him i got an introduction to the facebook pages team got it so i guess that <laughs> probably helped yeah <laughs> now you know. i know <laughs> because this a cold reach out really won't help in this no, case no that won't have helped yeah. yeah yeah how and how did you get to meet him what was the proposition um so you know uh, again i mean, of course facebook and whatsapp you see today right mm. and like even instagram to some extent all about communities right so um and parenting is an extremely important vertical mm. if you look at like the largest most thriving communities on facebook even today it's parenting and healthcare yeah um so yeah so i think that's really where you know mark wanted to know what was happening with us at baby chakra mm. and uh, it was an interesting like you know conversation maybe for him to have but certainly for me to have so when the team reached out and said that we're selecting a bunch of entrepreneurs across the world mm. for a one on one with mark i immediately signed up uh because you know it was an honor really yeah So that's been that story.